Hey guys, welcome to another LEGO video. Um, be warned, my parents are making lunch right now, so just if you hear anything, I accident. That's why. Anyways, though, um, today I'm going to be showing you, hopefully you see that back there? The big blue thing with a bunch of gray and black? Well, that is the Iron Man Hall of Armor. Today I'm getting, not really a review, but like... I don't know, kind of a review. I also got the Gucci hat back today. As you can see. Sorry, it's not an Amazon box that I just put on my head. Totally. And I have seen a review on this. At least the thumbnail. And it said, most disappointing set ever. And that set, right, right there was on it. But I don't think it's disappointing. Mainly because of the minifigures. <coughs> Specifically, this minifigure... And if any of you have seen any of the Iron Man movies, you've probably seen the first one. Which means that, I mean, I don't think that they made any sets for Iron Man 1 or any of the Iron Man movies for that matter. So I'm pretty sure that this minifigure is exclusive to this set. This suit, I don't think you can get this suit in any other set. I haven't done any research into it, but I could be right. And if I'm right, that's awesome. Comes with a transparent head, you know, but you can put an Iron Man, Tony Stark, or any Lego head under it. Um, the helmet does not open, because if you've seen the movie, um, it probably pause this and either click away or fast forward the video. I don't know how far, but probably like 30 seconds as of right now, not today right now. He had these flamethrower arm things and the front did not actually open that he made the arc reactor the original arc reactor in the cape that he was trapped in by the terrorists but anyways i don't know if that was 30 seconds i think it was shorter than that but just in case i i said it longer so i'm just gonna talk a little bit longer like uh i don't know i'm looking at the hype phone right now I'm not gonna call so i'm just gonna say that was 30 seconds now I I think I'll do this one next. I'll try to do it in a time span. Next is from Iron Man 2. Um, I th it's like the suitcase suit. This is also maybe a, a, a spoiler. So just it's, if you don't make care, that's fine. Just just saying, this video is probably gonna have a lot of spoilers in it. Um. It's from, like, the racetrack when Iron Man and Tony Stark were racing and then Whiplash came in and broke it and they never actually referenced his name in the entire movie. But you obviously know if you know Iron Man villains. This one does open to find out that it's like in, in Spider-Man Homecoming when there's no one in the suit. And, um, I never noticed this before, but look at down those legs. Can't see as well as I can, but it's... I don't know, I just never thought about looking down the legs. And then today, just earlier when I was getting the video set up, I just, I did. So that's interesting. Next is from Iron Man 3. Um, it's like the black and gold suit, still kept the gold, but it's quite different than the rest of them. Um, this is probably my least favorite. I think a lot of people would probably say it's their favorite. Um, but the one coming up next is probably my favorite. Um... You get a lot of minifigures in here. You also get some Outriders or whatever they're called. Because it's from Endgame, Infinity War, whatever. But it only has Iron Man in it. It just comes with Iron Man and a couple of suits and like a robot or something. I don't know. You open it up. Blank face again. Um, back detailing. Oh, speaking of back detailing. Look at this. I don't know if you read that. It says Stark Industries on that yellow piece. That is amazing detail. It's kind of small. It just says Stark End. It's for, st short for Industries. And then, anyways, though, next, there's a little bit more use because Iron Man is my favorite superhero. So, like, his head spins around way easier. And this one does have, does have a face. I don't know if this is the one that actually came with the sex. I have, like, two or three of this very same Iron Man minifigure. It's from the whole Infinity War movie. It's the original nano suit. Um, but it's also in, like, the beginning scenes of Endgame. And they fast-forward the time and stuff. But 
that's what this is. I think this set is from Avengers Endgame. I got it right around when Endgame came out, even though I didn't see the movie until... I don't even know, like... Probably Spider-Man Far From Home would come out. So, you know, the sequel, kind of, but not really. But anyways, though, that's all the minifigures. Um, this one does come with two faces. It comes with, like, a techno face for the suits, but I hate it. So if I'm playing with this or I'm using it for, like, a stop-motion movie, I have to, like, flip the entire head around. And this head, the helmet, is kind of, like, look at that. Just taking that off maybe gave him a really long neck, like mine. Okay, it's not that long, but if you look in the mirror from just, yeah, in the right angle, it does. So that's all the minifigures. Pretty short. Um, I'm going to be very careful with this. i try to show you what you could do if you are a serious Avengers fan. What you could do with your Avengers. Heh. Heh heh. Getting a little tour of my room. That's the closet. You probably hear my mom's voice now. Okay, where is it? There it is. You don't get a very good angle, but it's that big gray platform. I bought that specifically for this. Didn't already have it. Um, you got an Avengers truck, but the Black Panther's Rhino, Captain America. I know, not a very good angle. I don't have someone to help me lift that up today. I'm going to go really far away. Don't know how well you can hear me right now, so I'm just going to get out of the camera. Talk about a walk award. What the heck if there's a Lego bit in here? Check your Lego bins, or whatever you have. Check if you have this piece. Pretty old, I think. Oh, I landed it. I don't know if you saw that. Anyways, though, thank you for watching, guys. Um, okay, I missed that. Thank you for watching, guys, and I will see you in my next video. Um.